uh, Brad, a couple of weeks ago, we talked about radon. Remember, we were going over yeah. radon mitigation. Drew heard our show, and uh, he was wondering, and he's concerned about dangers of radon in a home that's a leading cause of lung cancer among non-smokers, second leading among smokers. But Drew wants to know, so how does radon occur, and where does it actually yeah. come from? He's looking, looking for more nuts and bolts. Okay, so radon is is actually a breakdown of a uranium gas, and the, and it's a it's a material that is in the rock that we are sitting on. There's two types. We have permeable uh, rock in this area, and we have impermeable. The impermeable, if your house happens to be sitting over an area that's impermeable, then likelihood of radon in, in your house is lower than a house that has permeable um, karst type of, of rock under them. Unfortunately, the area that we're in, because of all the cave systems, because of the, the karst uh, makeup of the ground, it's just, it's it's hit and miss. You know, there's there's pockets of radon neighborhoods. I think I'd mentioned that radonmap.com uh, website uh-huh. where you can kind of see where the hot spots are around the area. Um, but there are pockets, you know, like if you look at Norton Commons, most of the builders there just build a, a passive radon system into the home. It's it's set up from the time that they build it. They test it once the house is complete. If if the radon level is above that four picocuries per liter, then what they'll do is they'll just attach the uh, the fan and uh, then that will then become an active uh, radon mitigation system. So there's areas in town that it's just it's just where they are the you know nearly every home has it uh and then there's other areas of town that are less likely so you got to kind of look at your neighbors uh see whether or not they've got those big white pipes uh sticking out the side of their house going up to the roof line and uh you'll have a rough idea of uh, what's going on in in your neighborhood but yeah it's a it's a radioactive gas that's from the breakdown of uranium